Hi everybody and welcome back to BB's fun page on YouTube. I've sure missed you. Today is Monday, which means today we're going to learn about something in our body. Isn't that exciting? Well, today we're going to talk about our brain. Our brain is in the very top of our heads and it works kind of like a computer. It learns things and teaches us things and when we learn about them, they go into the knowledge or into the little computer thing in our brain. For instance, did someone teach you how to count? Do you know how to count to five? <gasps> you do? Let's do it together. One, two, three, four, five. Very good. Well, since you know how to count to five, something tells me your brain is working all right. Well, the things that we want to talk about in our brain today happen to be the five senses. And just like when you learned how to count, you'll use your senses to learn other things too. For instance, let's think about the last time we ate a meal. Oh, I know what mine was, a carrot, my favorite meal. Aren't I silly, but I love them. I can't help it, they're so yummy. Well, when I ate my carrot first, mommy cleaned my carrot, which then I noticed it was orange, a beautiful orange, kind of like a pumpkin. Well, the beautiful orange carrot looked so big. So I used my sense of sight. Very good. You use your eyes to look at an object such as my carrot. And I was able to see that my carrot looked yummy and was ready to eat. Hmm. The next thing I did, and this is a habit of mine, is I like to smell my food. So I took my carrot and I put him up to my nose. Oh, it smelled divine. It was yummy. It smelled just like a carrot and it was time to start eating. Well, mommy was teaching me a lesson so I had to go slow. She said, not only did I use my sense of sight, but I also just used my sense of smell. Can you believe I used two senses? just to look and smell at my carrot? Oh, but don't worry, it didn't end there. All the excitement of the day kept going. The next thing I did was I took my carrot and I put it between my teeth and I chomped down. Oh, it sounded so loud. Oh, speaking of loud, that is the third sense I used to have my carrot for dinner. It was the sense of sound or hearing. When you eat, do you hear what your mouth is doing? <laughs> Sometimes, huh? Like with carrots and apples, pretty much anything crunchy. Salad and oh, yummy, yummy pizza and all the yummy foods that make noises when you eat them. Of course, you should always eat with your mouth closed. Keep in mind, you always say please and thank you too, okay? All right, continue on with my lesson that my mommy taught me. Okay, so I've used my scene or my eyes for the sense of sight. I use my nose for the sense of smell. And I use my ears for the sense of hearing. <gasps> but it still didn't stop there. There were still more senses that I was using. Mama gave, took the carrot from me and then handed it back very nicely. And I felt the carrot. I realized that it was a little bit heavy. Oh, it was just a little bit crunchy. The way it felt was thick. And there were some little ridges on there where mommy had cut the dirty stuff off. So my sense of touch taught me more about that, ca that wonderful carrot that I was about to eat. It was so much fun. Now there is one more sense that I got to use when I ate my carrot. Can you guess what that would be? Well, let's review. First, it was the sense of sight because I was able to see my beautiful, what color? Orange, my orange carrot. The second one was my sense of 
smell because I could smell it with my nose and it smelled so good and clean. The third sense was my sense of hearing. Oh, my ears enjoyed to hear the crunch and was ready to go. And the fourth one was my sense of touch. And I could feel how thick and big that carrot was and was ready to start eating. So as I was taking that bite after I heard it, I started to taste that carrot. Oh, boy, it's my favorite taste in the whole wide world. Nothing beats a good carrot except maybe a good egg. <laughs> well, I learned so much just from eating my dinner last night. Mama says I'm pretty smart. Do you think I'm pretty smart? <laughs> you do? Well, guess what? I think you're smart too. And maybe the next time you have dinner, you can think about the five senses that you use to have your dinner. One last time, let's think again. We use our sense of sight, our sense of smell, our sense of hearing, our sense of touch, and our sense of taste. Very good. Well, you guys are just getting there with no problem. I enjoyed learning that lesson from Mommy, and I thought maybe you would enjoy it too. So if you like this lesson, ask Mommy and Daddy or a friend to write a little message to me. And I'll learn all about how you learned about the five senses too. And the next time we have a new video, you can let me know what you would like to learn about. Until then, I'll keep thinking of the things mommy and my teachers and my friends are teaching me. And we'll talk about them here in BB's Fun Time on YouTube. Well, it's been fun talking to you. I sure hope you have a wonderful rest of the day. We'll talk again soon. Love you. Bye-bye.